Hi, I'm Ray. Well, today I've got the kitchen garden and grow your own magazines. And we're out in a bit of a location today. We're actually by the waterfront, so you can might hear some water going by. But we've got our kitchen garden and grow your own magazine. I'm going to have a look and see what seeds we've got in the base of these magazines. So first of all I'm going to look at Kitchen Garden and this is February's edition and this is £6.50 and it says 10 packets of free seeds, claim your free blackberry plum, expert advice on potatoes, leeks and plums, money saving offers and giveaways, easy growing hot tips for seed sowing success. So let's have a look at what seeds we've got in here. So the first one we got is tomato and it's Roma VF. Tasty fleshy tomatoes with few seeds, great for cooking. So these can be sown indoors January through to April, plant out May, June, harvest from July onwards. That's tomato, Roma VF. Some nice big tomatoes. The next one we've got is carrot. And this is Paris Market 5 Atlas. Small round bite-sized carrots, fast to mature. Can be grown in containers or even on clay soils. That's good. So these can be sown March, April, May, June and harvest from June right through to October. And I might do some of these in a container. Got a good idea for that. I was wanting some little carrots. The next one we've got is beetroot. And this is Detroit 2, Crimson Clove. Easy to grow, tasty and very versatile. This can be sown April through to June, July, and harvest from July right through to October. And we haven't got any beetroot seeds, so that's a good one to choose. The next one we've got is Greyhound Lettuce. And this can be sown indoors, March, April, May, or outdoors, March, April, May, and uh, plant out June, and harvest from June right through to September. And then we've got kale. And this is a dwarf green curled, ultra hardy, a great source of winter greens. So these can be sown um, March, April, May, or sown outdoors March, April, May, plant out June and August, and then harvest from September onwards. So next in our packet, we've got is salad, Red salad bowl lettuce. And this is a large loose hedge made up from mass dark red serrated leaves. So this can be sown February right through to July and plant from April right through to August. We've got some of this just randomly growing on the allotment, on the plot I've just given up. The next one we could do is herb. And herbs, this is parsley, moss, curl. So I've just come back and I've just realised that the video was cut short and we were looking at the kitchen garden's seeds and we were at parsley and this is herb and this is a moss curled lovely dark green very curled variety ideal for adding to a variety of dishes one of the most popular garden herbs so this can be sown all year round and harvested all year round the next one we got is coriander and that's a herb and this is green aroma Especially bred for its ability to produce a lot of leaf and slowly slowness to bolt than traditional older types. So this can be sown all year round and harvested all year round. And the next one we got is basil. And this is a classic Italian. And this is a traditional med Mediterranean companion for tomato dishes. So this can be planted with your tomato plants and with the marigolds grow more together. And when you pick your tomatoes you can pick some basil at the same time. Useful for chicken and the central ingredients in pesto sauce. So this can be sown all year round and it can be harvested all year round. And then the last one for kitchen garden was kawabi. And this is purple delicacy. A popular vegetable in Europe. Deep purple skin with white to light green inner flesh. Delicious eating young in place of turnips or grated raw and salad. So this can be sown March, April, May, June, July, plant out May, June, July, 
and harvest from June onwards. So there we go. So I'll take you back and then we'll have a look at the Grow Your Own magazines. So the first one we got with our Grow Your Own magazine is Renova. And it's less thinning, produces one or two seedlings per cluster. Very good flavour, cylindrical roots with a few rings. So this is sown outdoors April, May, June, July and harvest July right through to October. So that's Renova. That's a long shape beetroot. The next one we got is lettuce and this is salad bowl. Crops all summer long, slow to run to seed. This can be sown March right through to August and harvest from April right through to October. So that's salad bowl. The next one we got is pepper. This is hot to cayenne. Good crops of long slim chilies. Eat as mild or green or moderately hot red peppers. So this can be sown indoors February, March, April. Plant out May, June and harvest June right through to October. And if you've got a propagator, it'd be great to stick those into the propagator. This is really nice. We've actually got some Cosmos, and I really like some Cosmos. And this is seashells mix, a half hardy annual, flowers the same year as sown. So this is really, really good. I'm really pleased I've got these. And these can be sown indoors February, March, April, sown outdoors April, May, and plant out May to June, and then flowers from June right through to October. And they really like cosmos, they really know like, really pretty flower, and that's going to be a really good one. I like that. And we've got some violas, and this is a hardy perennial, best grown as a biennial or annual. If you check out my video above, I'll add a video of how to grow violas from start to finish, and that is wonderful. So these can be sown indoors February, March, April, and sown outdoors May, June, July plant out from May right through to October and flowers right through to October and I've still got violas flowering in the, in the garden all now and even in the frosty weather they've been surviving which has been really really good. The next one we've got is a lavender and this is a French lavender, a hardy shrub, flowers the year after sowing, compact shrub with virtually evergreen aromatic leaves. So this is good because I've just given up my plot and I've just given up all my lavenders that are on those plots. So it's a good opportunity to, to sow some more. And this can be sown February right through to June, indoors, plant out from March right through to August, and then uh, flowers from June right through to September. So I'd definitely be doing this lavender, and that's a French lavender. So that's really interesting. That's a good selection from Grow Your Own so far. And then we've got some melons. But I'm definitely doing melons. My whole polytunnel is going to be full of melons this year. Vigorous plant, producing sweet fruits up to 700 grams. Suitable for greenhouse or outside in a sheltered position. This is melon melba. This can be sown indoors February, March, April. Plant out April, May. And harvest from August right through to October. So I'm definitely, definitely using those melons. 20 seeds. So I'll be definitely doing that. The next one we got is Cress, and this is American Land. Delicious peppery flavour, alternative to watercress. Easy and fast growing, quick to crop. And we've never really done Cress, but it'd be a nice experiment. Maybe do this with a daughter. And this can be sown outdoors from March right through to September, and harvest from April right through to November. So that'd be quite interesting to do as an experiment. Oh, the next one we've got is a tomato, and this is Tigerella. And if you check out some of my other videos, I've got many varieties of tomatoes. And one that I really do like growing is Tigerella. Check out the video above, and you can see how to grow Tigerella from start to finish. And this can be sown indoors January right through to April. Plant out April, May, June, and then harvest from June right through to October. And this is one tomato that I really, really do like doing. And now I've got some seeds, I would definitely do been doing this. And I've been told again this year not to do many tomatoes, as I, <laughs> as I do far too many. Next one we've got is a radish, and this is a scarlet globe. And that's quite a nice round radish, easy and fast growing, crisp round radishes. 
two between other beds and to crop before they mature. And that's a great idea. This can be sown outdoors February right through to September and harvest from April right through to October. So I should be doing that, Scarlet Glow. The next one we got is Cabbage. And this is Offenum 2, Flower of Spring. For spring or autumn cropping, hearted or green, solid pointed tasty heads. So this can be sown February, March, April indoors, so outdoors in May, June or August and plant out June, July, September, October, November. And that's interesting. That's a great cabbage offenum too. Right, and for the last one, we've got this thyme. A hardy shrub, often evergreen, can be grown in pots. Wonderful, unique flavour, works with many dishes. So this can be sown indoors, February, March, April, May, plant out May through to July, and harvest from August right through to the following April. So that is really, really good. And we've got a thousand seeds in there, so that's interesting. So I might have to do some herb growing, do some lavenders, and do some thyme. A quick look at the magazine. We've got free patio potato starter pack. Get set for spring. It's time to get key crops out of the starting gates. Let me show you how. And the unusual fruits you must try. So pounds on taking herb and flower cuttings. I have to take some cuttings from my ones on my old plot. And easy recipes to turn your harvest into meals to please a crowd. So there we go. And this is £6.99 and this is March edition 23. They both come out at the end of January and they're both the current editions in the store at the moment. So there we go. So I'm really, really liking the grow your own seeds with some flowers and some unusual herbs. And that's really good. So there we go. And if you're new to my channel, then please subscribe, ring that bell and watch some of these grow. That'd be wonderful. So thank you very much for now. Cheers.